congratulations and today I'm going to do a video of how do I treat my acne and how do I take off my makeup and all that so I hope you guys enjoy this video alright so the things that I use to take off my makeup clear my skin and all that is only two things okay I only use two things I use other things as well but these right here like I can't go wrong with it alright so I use um, apple cider vinegar with the mother so it looks just like this and I got this from Walmart a couple months ago and I, got, I probably had this for almost a year so this right here lasts a long time so yes so I get the apple cider vin vinegar with the mother and this is the best one so get the one that has the mother in it because it's raw and it's unpasteurized so yeah so I use that and I use um, TNN um, Dixon Witch Hazel and I use this as well on my skin okay all right so I'm gonna give you guys some background information about these two products and why do I use them and what do I put these products in all right so first I'm gonna talk about um, what I put these products in I put it put this in this travel bottle application and it's like this it looks like something that you put lotions in. I got this from Walmart um, and I will put my little my apple cider vinegar and my witch hazel in this one bottle so I will mix both of these products in this one bottle so I will do half and half of the apple cider vinegar and I will do um, the witch hazel so first I'll put the witch hazel in first and then I will put the apple cider vinegar alright so if I just use the apple cider vinegar that works as well but apple cider vinegar kind of does sting just a little bit if you have the one with the mother so it kind of does sting but it kind of clears up your skin so I will use half of that because sometimes it's a little bit too strong and also the smell so yeah um, but let's go ahead with the background information. Okay, so Witch Hazel, this is what it looks like. And Witch Hazel is a Australian, I can't, is it Australian? I cannot pronounce the word, but it's a, it's this word right here. I can't pronounce it though. But anyways, but it's derived from the bark and leaves of the Hamilius and Virginiana. And that's the plant and is used by Native Americans to treat skin irritation and tumors. And it's great to use as a um, natural cleanser and a toner. So I use that for a natural cleanser and a toner for my skin. And it also clarifies it is used to remove oily um, oils from your skin, um, irritated red damage blemish or inflamed skin so this is a very good product those who have acne eczema any kind of skin problem this is really good for that it also prevent blemishes blackheads and it removes all that oil um it also is good to put on bug bites so if you get bitten put this on there get a little cute tip swab it up and it will heal it up uh, it's also good for to fade bruises, uh, stop bleeding, and also help with hem hemorrhoid relief as well. I have never had hemorrhoids, so okay. But if you do have hemorrhoids in the future or right now, this is very good to try this on yourself. Uh, so, Witch Hazel is a very good product. So go ahead and check this out on your on your free time, whatever. Um, I don't think that you will need to. Um, have acne to get this if you just have any kind of skin condition you want to get rid of a bruise or a scar this would be good to put on there as well um but yes as you can see I almost use at least 95% of the bottle and this is really good and I talked about this in my favorites video um, before and I love witch hazel like witch hazel is the best it's just it's the best. Um, it, so, ooh, I'm sorry. 
But yes, so I got this from, I don't think I got this from Walmart. I can't remember where I got this from. But anyways, but you can check your CBS, Trader Joe's. I don't think Trader Joe's has this. Take the back. And just just look for any other store that has it. Um, but yes. And in here, let's see what the ingredients are. So it contains 14% of alcohol. And it is 100% witch hazel. Okay. But anyway, so based on all the things that's on here, I already said. So witch hazel is really good for acne. And the background on apple cider vinegar, it treats skin problems as age spots, acne. And you want to make sure you get the one with the mother in it. Don't just get the plain apple cider vinegar. Get the one with the mother in it. And this right here also um, unclog um, pores and removes the oil. And also balance your pH um levels so this is really good um you can use apple cider vinegar for so many things like i'll probably leave some links in the description box what this can do um i also use this for my hair not on my hair hair but on my scalp to remove my dandruff and itchy scalp so this is really good to soothe itchy scalp when you're about to deep condition and all that so make sure you try this on your scalp it's very Good to put on your skin, your armpits to remove any kind of smells and clean it up. Um, so, apple cider vinegar and witch hazel are like the best products to use. Um, there's so many benefits of witch hazel and apple cider vinegar. Like you cannot go wrong. Um, but yes, so that's about it about this video. But I use that to remove my makeup, to clear my skin. I'm, before I put on my makeup, so in the morning time, I will wake up, um, I will wash my face, as what, you know, generally, and I will put on my witch hazel and apple cider vinegar on a cotton ball, and I will rub it in there, and I will rub it on my face and my chest and my neck. And that's how I clear my skin, because when you go to bed, you know, you touch it, that pillow and all that, so make sure I wash my face with this before applying my makeup so at the end of the day when I'm about to take off my makeup of course I will use a towel a wet towel to wash my makeup then I will use my toner cleanser slash makeup remover and I'll put that on a cotton ball as well and I probably will use at least three cotton balls filled with this on my face and I'll just rub it all the way in and that's how I take off my makeup. So this right here is a really good product. Go ahead and try this and see that it works. Um, I will say if you will try this for at least two weeks straight, you will see improvement on your skin. Um, and I and I use this at least twice a day, one in the morning time and one in the evening time. So use this twice a day for two weeks and see how your skin will look. Um, so. I don't wear makeup all the time, so I've used this, this product for for a good almost two years, and it had works and it keeps my skin clear. It feels good on the skin afterward. It feels like my skin is clean. So go ahead and try this. If you want to try these hot end products at Sephora at Walmart and want to try Paracta, Paracta did not work for you like it did for me, go ahead and try this and this is really good, like, come on. And some of you guys have this at home. So go ahead and try this and I will touch you guys soon. Thanks for watching, subscribe, and bye!